Okay, I'm back. Um, Sesh Feet is really expensive here in Australia. Um, I got this off Oz sale. This was supposed to be the top coat. It was $30 with free postage. Um, by accident, they sent me the base coat, which is fine. They refunded me, sent me out the top coat. And somehow or rather, they sent me out the restore by mistake. So I've still got a top coat coming in the mail. I got this for free, the restore for free. And I'm still waiting on the top coat. But anyway, in this box, it has a glass bottle with 118 mils or 4 fluid ounces of the base coat. It has a little nozzle and it comes with a little bottle. The good thing about these big massive bottles of Seshvi is you're able to share it with friends and family. And that's exactly what I've been doing because that's a hell of a lot of base coat. And <laughs> I've got about 50 gazillion bottles of other base coat to go through. So anyway guys, I'm going to put the link to the Oz sale website you've just got to keep an eye out for it um OPI these are what my dad got me I I haven't had a very good run with OPI um my biggest thing is I buy something based on the color of the bottle like this this is really pretty I'd rush out and buy it when I come home and paint my nails it's this color the same as in the bottle what I don't like about what I've experienced so far with OPI is I'll go and buy something that's really pretty in the bottle. I paint my nails and the colour is horrid. So my dad um, talked to my friend that's a nail tech and thought he would give me a try on the minis. Just get me back in love with OPI because that's my friend's favourite nail polish. So he got me Oz the Great and Powerful and i now pronounce you because i really want to try this alpine snow that's supposed to be a really good white and i wanted to try this happy anniversary color so at least i'm you know going to give it a try and i want to see what the um rapid dry top coat is like to see if it's anything like um anything like feet um i'm just going to quickly take this color out because i've never actually had a look at it that's quite a pretty color it's like a goldy greeny goldy color and i do love the cute little bottles so i'm going to give it a try and see if i can fall in love with opi but this one here is just a um range of nudes and this one here is pretty much nudes with a nude colour. Oh, sorry, this one's more of a pink colour. Is it the same pink as in there? No. So this pink and this is more of a nude. That's more of a pink. But yeah, because he, um, she thought it would be a good idea for me to get these kind of colours to put under all the lace plates I've got. So I'll give it a go. But oh my god, that colour there is so gorgeous. That would look pretty as snow on Christmas nails. So he got me these two. He also got me a train case. Oh, he's just bought me so much nail polish. Um, for my Australian subbies, the Sinful Shine with Gel Tech is now sold at Target. I've seen it at one other place, but I can't remember off the top of my head. I think it was a pharmacy. Um, so you get step one, which is the colour, and step two, which is the top coat. Um, the colours are amazing. The top coat is very meh. It reminds me of their normal top coat. Runny. You know, it's not thick and glorious like the see how runny that is it's not thick like the um revlon gel envy top coat that's what i thought it would be like it just reminds me of the normal top coat but anyway the two colors i've got here please excuse my nails i've been cutting things up and whatnot today i'm about to change them is this amazing mystique 
that's the purple. Oh, it's like they looked inside my head and made my dream nail polish. Now I need to buy 50 backups of this nail polish in case they sell out because you know what I'm like with sinful colours purple. I need backups of backups of backups and I have owned this polish for under a week and I have painted my nails with it with about six, seven times and that's not a lie. And then my husband's like, because my husband brought me this colour of this set here He's like, maybe you need to get a Christmas colour. And this one here is Shine Annie. A beautiful red, and I know it's coming off as a salmon colour, but it's a red with like a pinky glitter. Like a fuchsia kind of glitter through it. The problem I'm having is, I'm so in love with this colour, I can't take it off to do my Christmas nails. I was hoping I would have enough of it by now, but it totally hasn't worked. So I'm just going to have to bite the bullet. And I've got snowflakes on my purple nails at the moment from my bundle monster plates. So I'm going to have to bite the bullet and take it off. My reason for telling you this is I looked everywhere for this stuff and I couldn't find it anywhere. So Target has it. At the mo oh, I think it finishes today actually. It was 40% off. Okay, next up is Insta Dry is sold at Red Dot. I caught the very last bottle. If I had seen them, I would have bought 30 of them because the stuff stamps are amazing. So, this color here is Wind Up and it's a wine color, believe it or not. But Insta Dry is really hard to get here in Australia. So I thought I would share that with you guys. Red Dot has it. Anyway guys, I am going to try... I've been awake for nearly 27, 28 hours. I work, dropped my husband off at the airport to fly back to work. And I've stayed awake to hang out with my friends and family. And now I want to change my nails. So... I might record that, I might not. I might just come back on and show you what I've done. But we'll see how I get on. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed that little um, um, little haul. And one thing I must say, these little minis are expensive. Really expensive. $24 a box. Nearly $50 for these two. Um... I went, I went to go and buy the OPI paints for a box of minis, $59. That ain't going to happen because I'd need 10 boxes. You know what I'm like with my backups once I like something. So anyway guys, I, like you. I hope you enjoyed that little haul and I will see you in the next one. Bye.